Have you heard this quote from Alexander Graham Bell? Before anything else, preparation is the key to success. This couldn't be more true, especially for anyone preparing for the Australian Dental Council ADC exam. Success in this exam is all about focused, thorough preparation. So today we will break down the syllabus and exam pattern to help you prepare smarter and boost your chances of success. Are you ready? Oh, and before we go ahead, did you know that Academically is an edtech company that helps healthcare professionals move their careers to the country of their dreams? If not, then you are missing out. Be sure to subscribe to our channel to stay updated with all the latest information. Now, let's get started. You might know that the ADC exam is for dentists who wants to practice dentistry in Australia. The exam basically consists of two parts, a written exam and a practical exam. First, the written exam is a computer-based multiple choice test held over two days. The questions are scenario-based, meaning that for each scenario, you will have five related questions. In total, the exam has 280 questions split into four sections, 70 questions per section. You will have two hours to complete each section with two sections on day one and two on day two. If you see the syllabus of the ADC exam, you will have dental emergencies covering 7%, endodontics about 8%, general medicine, medical emergencies and special needs dentistry around 9%, infection prevention and control about 5%, oral medicine and pathology for about 9%, oral surgery for about 8%, Pediatric Dentistry and Orthodontic 8%, Pain and Behavior Management 7%, Periodontics 8%, Preventive Dentistry 8%, Radiography 5%, Implants 4%, Removable Prosthodontics 6%, Pharmacology 10% and Restorative Dentistry including Fixed Prosthodontics 12%. This will assessed based on Professionalism, Health Promotion, clinical information gathering, diagnosis and management planning and clinical treatment and evaluation. Now, next, let's move on to the practical examination. The practical exam takes place in Melbourne, Australia and is spread over two consecutive days covering both technical skills and clinical skills. The hands-on assessment occurs in a simulated clinical lab setting. On technical skills day, you will demonstrate restorative skills on typodont models in a mannequin. This part of the exam focuses on conservation, endodontics and fixed prosthodontics. You will have six tasks to do. Then on clinical skills day, you will face a station-based objective structure clinical examination or OSCE. Here you will be assessed on areas like clinical information gathering, diagnosis and management planning and clinical treatment and evaluation. Now here you will have 10 tasks to do. Preparing for both parts of the ADC exam requires not only a solid understanding of the syllabus but also practical experience. It might look a challenging exam but with the right approach and help from Academically's ADC preparation course, you will be well on your way to practicing dentistry in Australia. Remember Remember, hardships often prepare ordinary people for an extraordinary destiny. That's all for today guys. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more insights into healthcare career opportunities abroad. And if you are looking for personalized guidance, you can even get a free 101 consultation with the experts at Academically. Check out the link in the description. This is Sunidhi Shahi signing off.